Dr. Todd Brennan here with Healthy Feet Podiatry in Tampa, Florida. So we're here to talk to you today about cryosurgery, a great game changer in helping to fix foot pain and neuromas. So a lot of you have dealt with neuromas over the years and you've tried many things, whether it's injections, wide shoes, uh, pads, whatever it could be. And you've probably have been told that the only thing left to do is surgery. Well, today I'm telling you that that's not it. There is other options to treat neuromas and that is cryosurgery. So cryosurgery offers us a minimally invasive way to help treat and fix your chronic foot pain, specifically neuromas. If you're trying to avoid the more invasive options that do come with its laundry list of complications, this is exactly what cryosurgery is for. So the science behind cryosurgery is actually relatively simple. It's just as if you would hurt yourself and put ice on a specific area, we go in with a probe under ultrasound guidance and an ice ball forms directly on the damaged or injured nerve. And what that allows the body to do is try to regenerate healthy nerve tissue, which in turn should help alleviate the symptoms that you're getting that correspond with that painful neuroma. The cryo itself drops to significantly low temperatures around negative 200 degrees Fahrenheit. And by doing so, it helps to kind of constrict that blood flow and allow that nerve to start that reparative and healing process. So the thought would be is that we have these inflamed injured damaged nerve cells and what the cryo is trying to do is trying to get the body to shed those damaged nerve cells and allow it to repair and fix itself with healthy new nerve tissue to again get rid of the symptoms and make you feel better so you may be wondering what some of the benefits of cryosurgery are comparatively to the other traditional surgeries number one is it's minimally invasive so you're not having this large incision on the top of your foot it's a very tiny incision complication risks are pretty much null and void. But more importantly, it's regenerative. And today's day and age in, in the health world, that's what everybody wants. They want regenerative medicine that's allowing your body to repair itself, that's not putting medications or even surgeries in other regards into your body and letting your body take care of itself. So you may be wondering what some obstacles or downsides or concerns of cryosurgery are. Number one is following the procedure. Some people do notice a little bit of hypersensitivity to the area because we are stimulating the nerve for healing purposes. That's not unusual, that's very common. And I can honestly say that nobody I've done cryosurgery on has had any long-term complications other than just a stubborn recurrent nerve, which brings me to the second possibility, is recurrence of the neuroma, right? We're not removing the nerve, we're just trying to let the nerve rehabilitate and repair itself. And because of this, there is always that risk and possibility that you could get a flare-up of the neuroma down the line, whether it's with a certain activity or a certain shoe that you wear. Timing, you know, it does take time for a nerve to regenerate. It's not an immediate relief type of thing. While there are some patients that do get immediate relief around the two week mark, that's not the norm. For some, it does take weeks, if not months, for that nerve to repair itself and feel better and get you back on your feet quickly. Uh, last but not least is the cost. Cryosurgery is a very niche procedure. I want to say there's maybe 10 to 12 people in the country that do it, if not the world. And because of that, there's high demand and low supply. So because of that, the cost can be a big factor in determining whether somebody wants to do that or not. So when you're trying to determine, do I do the traditional surgery or the cryosurgery, really it comes down to one thing, and that's complications. The biggest complication associated with the traditional neurectomy surgery is a stump neuroma, which means you have the same neuroma symptoms just a little further back in your foot. Whereas with the cryosurgery, while we're not cutting the nerve out, the risks of complications are very minimal, if at all. The biggest risk that I tell all of my cryosurgery patients is recurrence, and that's just simply because we're not cutting the nerve out. I can honestly say that I've never done cryosurgery on somebody who's gotten worse. If they fall within that 15% of the patients that don't improve from the cryosurgery, they're dealing with the same symptoms they were pre-surgery, not worsening symptoms. So is cryosurgery for you? Well, if you're looking for a more natural, minimally invasive approach to fixing your chronic neuroma or foot pain, I would say it is. However, you always wanna make sure that you consult with your physician or myself here at Healthy Feet Podiatry before jumping to any drastic approach or medical advancements to taking care of your foot pain.